Goals are a goal, and so don't feel bad if you have to step back and adjust that goal. Sometimes things happen in the world or things happen in our lives and goals need to be adjusted. Hi, and welcome. Today in this three-minute video, I want to talk about understanding that the main goal when setting our insurance goals and our career goals is to really achieve excellence. And my name is Bobby Fernandez. I'm a performance coach here at Agency Performance Partners. And we work with insurance agents and insurance agencies just like you every day to help set goals. The first thing we have to do is make sure that we are setting realistic goals. We have to really look at the measurable things that we have in our back pocket, the things that we can measure currently and understand when we're setting those goals, how realistic are they? Obviously, I want people to dream big. I want you to achieve all of your goals, but we have to work in steps to achieve our goals. We can't just right out of the box, go out and meet all of our goals all of a sudden right up front. Especially if I'm a newer agent, maybe joining the insurance industry, I have to have some realistic goals about the timelines that it's going to take me to achieve that next step in my career. Or if I'm an agency principal, I have to understand what are the metrics of my agency from last year to this year so that I can set realistic goals and that way we don't frustrate our team. Then we want to make sure that we ask for feedback when we're setting goals, especially when we're talking about career goals. I want to get feedback from the people that know me, work with me, have an understanding of what it is that I'm looking for and get that true and honest feedback about my performance and about myself. Sometimes we don't always see certain things about ourselves, be it good or bad. And we want to make sure that that feedback, we take that in, we listen to it and we understand where we're really starting from when we're setting a goal so we know that that goal is realistic. Then we wanna make sure that we're able to track our goals using metrics. We need some kind of measurable, whether that is I wanna be able to have meet a certain sales number by a certain date, or I want my agency's retention to be at 92%. What are the things that we're working for? So making sure that we're tracking those goals and that we're using metrics when we're doing that. And then accountability is super important. Whether we're setting our own goals or whether we're setting our agency's goals, we have to understand that we have to hold people accountable. We have to have the right people on our team and we want somebody, even if it's my personal goals, I need somebody to help hold me personally accountable and check in on me. And that way I never lose sight of where I'm going. And then I need to make sure that I feel comfortable adjusting those goals as needed. Goals are a goal. And so don't feel bad if you have to step back and adjust that goal. Sometimes things happen in the world or things happen in our lives and goals need to be adjusted. So this is not a sign of failure. This is really a sign of courage to reassess those goals and make sure that you adjust them as you need to. And then it's super important that every year annually, you revisit those goals, recalibrate, and make sure that you have the right cheerleaders on your team and the right accountability partners, because we're here to achieve excellence. When we achieve excellence, our clients achieve excellence and our agency grows. So if you need assistance in setting career goals, setting your agency goals, we are here to help you. Go out and book your meeting now. Check out our blog on our strategic planning. This is super important and every agency needs to do strategic planning one time a year. And so get out there, get that workbook, help you work through those goals. We look forward to talking to you soon. Have a great day.